Now, I really wish I could start this video singing Free Little Birds and trying to do the whole toxic positive narrative and everything. I can't even be asked for that gimmick today. I actually can't be bothered with it. I've seen some embarrassing performances in my life. This. This one right here. Might be worse than any of them that I've seen. What was that? What was that performance? I, I, I keep emphasizing it because I can't even believe it myself. This was not just a 19th place Burnley team. This was a 10th, a 10 man Burnley team with no manager. They had their assistant manager, Craig Bellamy, in the dugout. I ain't heard that guy's name in a decade. And we couldn't win. We scored one goal in open play. One goal. In 90 minutes. At home. Against Burnley. Like, where do you even start with that? Like, the first thing I want to say, we are not isolating anybody. We are not going to say it's all on the players. We are not going to say it's all on Poch. We're not going to say it's all on the directors. We are going to say it's on all of them. It is a collective. As a collective, you have failed. You have absolutely failed and embarrassed this football club today. It's as simple as that. All of you have to hold it. For Pochettino, the defensive structure is a joke. The set pieces, defensively and offensively, are offensive. They're disgusting. We can't make a corner to save our lives, and we definitely can't defend one to save our lives. Our inability to break down a low block has followed you from the Tottenham days. But that's just you. And also, to be objective, I'll give you credit for the substitutions. I never expected you to take Gallagher off, because I know you, and you took him off early. Fares. I was against Caicedo for Sterling, but it made sense and we got an assist, so fares. But everything else I said before stands. For the players... Like, the mentality is in the toilet, and it's been flushed. It's absolutely disgraceful. Zero composure in front of goal. Zero composure at set pieces. Nobody is imposing themselves in that defense except Malo Gusto. Nobody else. We have rash fouls literally everywhere across the pitch. We sit back whenever we get a goal, even though that is probably partly due to the manager as well. But the mentality sucks. The mentality absolutely sucks. This was a Palmer masterclass ruined. Ruined by everything else. Caicedo was decent. Gusto was decent. Petrovic bar the second goal was decent. Bar that, you all stunk. Simply put, you all stunk. This is a 10-man Burnley team that we drew to. This genuinely feels worse than a loss. We were rushing the first 10 minutes. Then we got some control. Didn't look like we were scoring until we got a pen and two red cards. Just our luck. Scumbaggery, but we'll take it. Straight after half time, we concede a wonder goal, to be honest. It's a good one, too. It's a nice smash and grab goal from Burnley. They take it, it is what it is. I don't really have anybody to blame for that one. But it's typical Chelsea after a second half, isn't it? Start the second half slow, concede early. It's just us. It's just us all over. To a T. Then you give them the impetus to sit back and play the putrid old Sean Dyche brand of football that only Burnley know how to do. But they're down to 10 men. And what do we do? We just die. We just die. That's what we did. We struggled. Absolutely struggled. To break Burnley down. Wow. Unbelievable. I, I I can't believe it. We were talking about how the next four games were all winnable. How I want 12 points out of our next four. And we fail at the first hurdle. 
We just fail at the first hurdle. It's just not good enough. It's just absolutely pathetic. Now I don't feel confident going into any game. And it's funny enough because now we've got our favourite bogey team coming to the bridge in Manchester United. A team we haven't beaten since 2017, by the way. That game is going to be a laugh for everybody else except us when we turn them into 1970s Brazil again. I can't wait for that. Then we go to Sheffield United. Now, I'm going to say this very calmly. I'm going to say this calmly. If you dare, if you dare leave Bramall Lane with less than three goals, less than three points, and a clean sheet, walk back. All of you walk back. Walk back from Sheffield. Walk backwards back to the bridge. You don't deserve a coach. You don't deserve a train. You don't deserve a plane. You don't deserve anything. If you go to Bramall Lane and embarrass us the way that I think we're going to do now, because I have no confidence for any game coming up now. No confidence. Let them walk. Except Cole Palmer. Let them all walk. And I mean it, because this is absolutely disgraceful now. Or I've, I've tried so hard to defend these players, and I still stand by the fact that these players should not be in, in 11th place. But today, today you played like it. Today you played like a team that should be in 11th place. And if your name ain't Cole Palmer, Gusto, Caicedo, I ain't defending you. I ain't defending you. You have to hold that shame. You have to hold that embarrassment. Because you embarrass the shirt. You embarrass the fans. You embarrass the club. All of them got embarrassed. Mudrick disappeared second half. Um, Jackson disappeared second half. Enzo disappeared second half. Sterling, nice assist. Then you missed the howler. Typical. Typical. Disasti and Badi Ashil. You gotta be more imposing. What the hell was that today? All this to a 19th place Burnley team that didn't even have Datro Fafana or what's his name? Colio Show. And we still couldn't win. Ah, oh, this team is driving me insane. They're driving me mental, man. They're literally driving me fucking insane. I, I can't believe it, man. I, I, I need a zoot. I need a zoot. Big up to everybody that's locked in. Hit the like button. Subscribe. We are an absolute embarrassment. I'm here reporting on what was Chelsea Football Club. We have reverted back to Fulham Broadway FC. But hey, to the toxic positive lot in the chat. At least now, we got to 40 points quicker than we did last season. Great. The road to 40 points is completed. Hope you're happy with yourselves. Potch out. Players need to hand their wages back, but I know it's not going to happen, so there's no point venting about it. You're all a disgrace. You're all an absolute disgrace. Potch out.